Also, if you are going for a wise government church for attending the wise government church for the first time, please I implore you in the name of the most I try and make you chop something, go eat. <laughs> because they are savage, they know the Russian. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, welcome on another wonderful edition of the Five Things Show with Alfred Samuel, the God on the Airwaves. And this day, I want to tell you five things you should know when you are invited to a white garment church. As you can see, me too, I'm the way white. <laughs> but then, if you are invited to a white garment church, you have Celestial Church of Christ, Jeremy Christi, Latokewa, we have CNS, it could be IO New, it could be anything. But if it is a white garment church and you've been invited, why would you want to honor such invitation for several reasons? Maybe I won't be one of your crushes that <laughs> invite you for the church, or your guy, or your boss, or your friend, or you just feel like attending, or you are considering changing your denominations. It could be anything. So I want to tell you five things you should know when you are going or when you are attending a, five, a white garment church for the very first time. Number one thing is that it is not compulsory for you to wear sutana. Yes. You can actually go in plain clothes that they call Ashwara. Yes, it is not compulsory you go with your sutana. But one of the things you must be mindful for is that there's something called Jukala Ashwara. If the whole cathedral is like 2,000 people and you are just the only one wearing plain clothes, now only you go dance, go forward. <laughs> so if you don't want to try that one, make you just go find sutana borrow. But you can go without sutana. Number two thing is that you are not permitted to wear shoes into a white garment church or into the premises i think uh, celestial church of christ you're not permitted to put in on shoe in the premises but for cns you can still pull off your shoe at the entrance of the church but you are not permitted to wear shoe inside the auditorium inside the cathedral so you know what i would advise you to do just go with a lilac bag pull your shoe put them inside a lilac bag because you never can tell <laughs> It depends on the year really church day. Or you go there with your car, just pull your shoe and keep it inside your car. But you're not permitted to wear shoes inside a white garment church. Also, if you are going for a white garment church for attending a white garment church for the first time, please I implore you in the name of the most I try and make you chop something, go eat. <laughs> because they are savage, they know the Russian. You know, be like all those Pentecostal churches, so we say 45 minutes, one hour, one hour, 30 minutes, two hours, they don't finish service. For see a white garment church, they know the Russian. Tell him about what's so kale. If LM is you come down, but I don't enter on that day. So please chop before you go wise garment shot. Then they say their service they long well well. Number four, if you are a woman, if you are a lady and you are at that period of the month. You may not be welcomed in a what now in a white garment church because everything is all about purity. So if a lady is impure, and I say impure, you know what I mean. If a lady is having a monthly flow, monthly menstruation, you are not permitted to enter what now the auditorium of a white garment church. In fact, you should not go out to go to church on that day. And the last but not the further, the least, the fifth thing that you should know when you are honoring an invitation to a white garment church is that black color black color is not what now is not permissible black black color is not is not is not allowed you should not wear a black color uh attire black color whatever when you are going to a white garment church. don't forget i said you may want to go there with your plain cloth but please in trying to do so try to respect your host try to respect their what their own rules black clothes keep it outside keep it off Keep it outside. Don't go with the black clothes. So, ladies and gentlemen, if you can keep those five things in mind, the next time you are being invited to Ikode Agbole, Ikode Alomole, or Kine Kompari, if you are launching our bomb. And of course, in case you want to go babe hunting, you know when it comes to babes. Why dimensions? Twilight for you. Ladies and gentlemen, don't go, don't go, don't go without subscribing to this channel. Just go below this video, subscribe, set the notification because every day of the week I try as much as possible to give you five things about five different things. After that, someone is the name. See you next time. Bye for now.